Rocky. Rocky's so smart. So his fall was here, and the door was open, and he was like here, and then I was petting him, and I was like, where's your ball? And then he like started pawing under here. I was like, how did he know it was over there? <laughs> I hide it. Oh no, I couldn't hide it in time. <laughs> He's getting tired. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I don't have it. Where is it? <laughs> I can't find it this time. <laughs> Where is it? Where is it? Let's see. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? It's over there. It's over there. <laughs> <laughs> I had to show him where it was. He got tired. <laughs> when he gets tired, he just carries his ball somewhere else and then leaves it. Let's try some of these pies. Creamy fudge. This apple one. Hmm. Yeah, You've never a seen a pie like this mm -hmm. before. No, no. Interesting. You want that guy? Put away. I don't know how this is fudge. It's like a caramel or something. It's like caramel cheese. Hmm? Yeah, it looks hmm. like caramel cheese. Mm hmm. How's that fudge? <laughs> it is good though. County of Brant. 40,000 population. So the signs here, they make like a little crown. <laughs> Frankfurt's Power Tower, Telephone City. Our truck has a lot of tires. What are those middle ones for? Is it if it gets because stuck somewhere or if it's too heavy? It has really heavy duty well, hinges here. The truck's following us. It also has hinges on the top, so the top must open. Interesting. That truck has 30 tires. What? <laughs> I don't know what's going on, but there's a bunch of traffic here. Emergency detour route. Someone's walking up there. Stay on Red Hill Valley Big Parkway speed North. Limit. There's a bridge over there. We're getting closer to the border. All the water there. I don't think we can see it from here. <laughs> Got a water park over here. A bunch of traffic again. The truck has a lot of smiley faces on it. <laughs> I've seen Lincoln. All the birds.
two kilometers. Okay, we're charging now at Dollarama. I was told it's four dollars plus, but anyways, here we go. We got the charger again. It's always backwards as usual, so you can't back into it uh, to open your doors and stuff. You'll end up hitting stuff, or it's in the way of your trunk. But uh, anyways, we're gonna charge for a bit and then continue on to Niagara Falls. Donated by the Kiwi Kiwanis Club of Stanford. They're at. Tim Hortons, let's go. <laughs> the outdoors is closed for cleaning. What? Okay, we have like pizzas and other stuff here. All these little treats. My brother said those, those are good. Wildberry cheesecake, that sounds good. Fruit explosion. And we got one of these. Okay, we're gonna try Tim Hortons. We got some donuts and Sheena got a coffee, but I'm not gonna try the coffee because I'm pretty sure coffee just tastes like coffee. <laughs> Alright, let's try this latte. It has some whipped cream on top. It's not aesthetically, ah. um, not aesthetically looking. It's, it's decent. It's, it's pretty decent. good. It's decent. It's sweet it's too and creamy. Sweet, though, for latte. Too sweet? <laughs> I think it's, it's good. Okay, so we got these three Nutella donut, whatever that strawberry thingy, wild cheesecake. wildberry cheesecake, and this some gooey stuff inside okay so that has some jelly as well as cream and then this one's just nutella, nutella. <laughs> all right so this has jelly and cream cheese or something in it this one has only the jelly no cream cheese mm. has a little crispiness like cereal uh oh close the windows very good cream cheese hmm Nutella stuff. It's very much still has the Nutella. Mm hmm. You got more people looking at the car. <laughs> Alright, here's this. Mm hmm. Actually, her mom Pretty good. and dad. So one guy that was charging uh, was telling us the story of Tim Hortons, how it's a hockey player and um, that he was gifted like a Panamera or something and then he ended up driving it off like some ramp and like crashed and died and that was gifted to like police retired police officer or something Tim Hortons and then uh, now so basically that retired police officer got like billions of dollars from that and he was like yeah telling us all about <laughs> and people are like taking pictures but uh, sure yeah, so it's kind of interesting. He was like telling us, oh, and do you know like the KFC guy? Yeah, he like lived in, I forgot where, somewhere in Canada. <laughs> and I was like, what? So, and telling us like uh, Kraft macaroni was made in Canada, but it's only in the US for some reason. I don't know. But, yeah. Anyways, let's go. All right, we charged too much. We're at 100%. <laughs> let's go. Yeah, We're at 73 degrees Fahrenheit, 426 p.m. Oh no, what happened? That guy got sideswiped. There was one lady that she came and then she was like going and then she just stopped in the road. Like, well, not in the what? road, but where the charger is, like in the... So there's parking spots like right next to it, right? But she stopped like in the actual lane for cars. <laughs> and then she was like, can I take a picture? Like I've seen, I've only seen like one other one. And then the other guy that was telling us about the Tim Hortons and stuff, he said, oh, like, like while it was moving right and he's, she was like yeah and she's like yeah like and she took a picture and then after like some other car came like driving and she was she wasn't in the way because she was on the other side of traffic so pointed the opposite direction but then she was like saying they can go around and then oh my God. <laughs> yeah, I mean I was like they're supposed to go that way anyways that's the lane so it's, she's not blocking them but I'm like there's parking spots right like right next to where she stopped so she was saying my daughter's like probably embarrassed because I'm a driving instructor instructor <laughs> and she's like come on mom <laughs> and I was like like you're a driving instructor and it's like you're recording a cyber truck on the road while it's moving and you're stopping in the middle of a lane to get out and take a picture of the cyber truck <laughs> it's like there's a lane there's a parking spot right next to it just park there 
<laughs> yeah, that was funny. <laughs> There's the water tower. I don't know if that's oh. the reason. Niagara yeah. region, something. There's a sign behind that says high collision intersection. I think it's because people are taking pictures of this and then not paying attention in the crash. There's some <laughs> Lundy's battlefield thing. See? That along with that water tower, that's how you get high collisions. Uh -huh. I don't know if it's a, it looks like a cemetery or something, see? So maybe this is some battlefield's memorial or something. Wait, where are we going? We're going towards this Niagara Space Needle spaceship thing that they have in Seattle and in Toronto. <laughs> Time to go eat up there. Just kidding. <laughs> 200 meters. Turn right onto Falls View Boulevard. What? There's also a what you would call Ferris wheel. Yeah, I guess no, somewhere. It's wheel. Yeah. Falls View Boulevard. We're going somewhere over here. Look, there's some flower wall here. <laughs> Mural. Oh, oh, this is In where 200 we meters, uh, turn uh, left onto Murray Street. The tour, the really bad tour bus guy. Bad tour bus <laughs> guy. <laughs> Look at this bridge. It's still down there. The parking areas. Okay, we can see the Niagara Falls here. Look yeah. at it. Now turn oh right no, bus, get out of the way! I'm trying to record. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No, people, get out of the way! I'm trying to record. <laughs> Wow, look at all the mist. <laughs> oh no, my car's getting wet. I can't see. It's raining. <laughs> so, we're only here right now. And, like, imagine if we're down there. I know, even they, just they up here, we're getting all this mist. Look at that. Can you see the water on there? There you go. Oh, you missed it. It was making a <laughs> rainbow. And the mist was making rainbows. You can see those um, flag colors in the Canadian. Interesting. Wow. How do we get over there? We need to find a parking spot. Get out, water. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Look at that bridge there. Up there. Up there. Oh. Wow, look at Into that. The rapid water flow. Fraser Hill. Whoa. There's no way this one was fake. Whoa, look at that. That's crazy. That's so nice. Okay, $35. So you pay it on exit. It's 35 Canadian. That means it's 30 US probably. <laughs> Alright, we're here. I don't know how far we're going to have to walk. I don't know if I should park down there instead. If it lets us walk down that way, then we'll just walk there and then walk all the way across the part that we drove. And I don't know what's going on with this roof. What, what's with that roof? Why is some like weird like flat metal and then some is like some weird textured? <laughs> That's weird. I missed it. They had so many duckies and stick on their dash and all the stickers. And they saw my truck and they're like, oh my god. I was like, but oh my god, all those duckies. <laughs> so this is the Niagara Parks power station. Canada also has black squirrels. Well, it's running! Hey, look, they twisted that tree while it was a little baby and now it's born growing as twisted. How mean. Look at that twisted tree. <laughs> Water here. Casino. Over there. The What's that one that's shaped like a torch? We got this little building here by itself. They have a little gas meter, so they're charging somebody for gas. <laughs> There's the Ferris wheel all the way over there. Ah, too jiggly. There's the Niagara Parks power station. Zoom out. Whoa, like look at that. Tour, like the what? Learned, they go over there? Like what it was. There's a big rusty what? I don't know if it's a cargo or... A ship tried to go over here. They're like, we're like Titanic. Nothing will sink us. <laughs> See? Look at the bridge. They 
coat this with something so it doesn't rust. Let's see, the river rapids. There's a big dome building over there in the back. There, all the Canadian geese on the Canadian side, and some seagulls that are are invading the Canadian side. <laughs> you can see a rainbow of mist. A little bit. Well, actually, we have to move. It's not as good. Of, we have to get a better angle of the rainbow. I'm surprised with all those rapids. Like right here, it's very quiet. The water. It's pretty quiet here. Yep. Canadian geese. Look, see, the Canadians are guarding the border from those seagulls, but some imposters made it past. Look. Look at those. Those aren't geese, those are ducks. <laughs> There's a couple of ducks that made it across a green one and a brown one. Oh, the seagulls are going. You got those other little ones. Look at those guys. Those cuties. <laughs> Another one of those towery looking buildings hidden behind that green one. It's getting louder, we're getting to the river rapids. You can see the rainbow in the distance over there. I don't know what they tied down there. Why is there a string there? Somebody trying to go fishing? Get all that water. Look, it's so clear, you can actually see underneath where the, like, what the actual land is. Oh, that seagull's going off. The seagull's going off. It doesn't look like it. It looks like somebody built that. No, I think that's for the power plant. That's for the, the power company. Pretty sure they built that cement there. See the... Rainbow there. There's wheel. Look at the mist going up. The Canadians are coming back home. <laughs> Yeah, that wall there's not, that's man-made. It's for the power plant, I'm sure. Some meat poles. Nice. What is this, a tree fort? What's in this tree fort? Whoa, look at that. If it starts raining, you hide in the tree umbrella. They have this. Why is this Canada and that's America? Because borders <laughs> and it's in French too but if you're on my channel you probably can read English so <laughs> look at this why is there a lump in this road people kept walking on both sides so much that the middle stayed like stuck and this people walk so much it pushed down both pathways <laughs> they have this history of Toronto. And I don't need the French part. Here you go. That's, that's part of like the thing. The What's this? 23,000 years ago. It went from like that to like that. Oh, it's gonna be wider soon. Yep. Everything's gonna fall into the <laughs> into the falls. We have this here. All these scam noculars. Look at that. What's all that netted around over there? Oh, you can walk down there? There's people walking down there. You can walk down there for free. <laughs> what are those thingies? What thingies? Some trolleys going up a ramp thingy. 
not like a, it's like on a track. It's that castle looking building there. Look at that. Whoa. It's like a crater and all the water's just falling in. Hi, Burb. <laughs> Hi, Burb. Are you hungry? I don't have any food for you. Don't peck me, okay? Hi. Hi. Get that waterfall. Oops. Waterfall with the burb. Oh. Hi. Danger, don't climb, because you'll fall in the water probably. Now this guy in here. There go. There's a rainbow getting sucked into that pit. Wow, look at the, the rainbow's getting sucked into the pit. Going into the boats going under. It's too misty to see. Let's see where they go. They also have a place, a little place, old building there, abandoned. Hey, people are down there. Doing construction? Oh, there's the other end of the rainbow. So it goes from there to there. The middle is invisible. Is that, what is that? Pollution? Or is that sand? What is that? Is that like a shore? Is it gross foam or is it like some kind of sand? What is that? Look at the rain from the waterfall, the mist coming down. Whoa. Yeah, it's foam. I zoomed in. It's foam. You can see like where it broke away. And it's moving with the water. Look at the ships going in. There's the American side. See, they have the they have the flag and the prisoners of war thing there. Where's the Canadian flag? They just have this oak leaf. That's not even Canadian. <laughs> okay, I think the Canadian flag is all the way. Yep, I see it. I see it. It's at that, whatever that border thing where they pulled me over and made me pay. Or they didn't make me, well yeah, they made me pay five dollars <laughs> to cross. Look at them all going in there. Uh, they're going in the water. Can uh, Canadian and US flags. Oh. They're going in. <laughs> Where does all this water come from? There's no mountains over there. Where's this water? They stop, they're not going closer. <laughs> they're going very slow. 
I found out how you can switch, like, to... <laughs> you go on that boat and you come out on the wrong border. <laughs> They make you pay the toll when you come back up, five dollars. <laughs> Rainbow's going, but still disappears. I guess they don't go until they're turning around now. They're going back. Getting out of there. To the seagull. The ship went away, turning back, going back to port over there. We're walking to the waterfalls. Yeah, they're doing construction there. Cars are going down there. At least I think they're doing construction. <laughs> Looks like they have yellow hard hats. This hotel must be very expensive for the blue mountain high. Yep. You can see the waterfall out there. That was the American over there. Top of the falls restaurant. That boat has less people on top. Their ponchos flying away. <laughs> Guys, ponchos flying away. What happened? <laughs> There's the power plant all the way over there. that bird. those blackbirds. Oh, the helicopter came over this way. Looks like a fish. <laughs> Okay, there's
there's this table rock. And then they have the uh, Nikola Tesla Plaza. And there's the guy. I was trying to get a picture of that. And then I said, no, get off the statue. And then he started taking off his jacket. I said, no, don't. I said, get off, not take it off. Hurry, get out. Let me take a picture now. Okay, that's how they do the lights onto the waterfall, it seems. Oh, all these tour buses coming here. here. They have an elevator going up and down. Second waterfall here. And here's the gross foamy stuff island. There's the foam island. Look at that. I'm surprised they don't have one scoop have someone scooping it up and throwing it away. <laughs> Adds color to the <laughs> Add some yellow to the landscape. Oh, there's some other ships over there. What are those? Back up. There's the seagulls down there. The seagulls are going and eating that yellow water. I guess that's why they don't scoop it up and clean it up. It's like stuff for the seagulls to eat. The stuff hides in there. The seagulls seem to like that stuff. So that's those blue things see how come some people are down there they don't look like they're doing construction did they sneak down there <laughs> see there's a bunch of construction workers down there are they working on something and then those random two people there I think they snuck down there <laughs> They have a little cable thingy that's moving over there. What is that? Is there like a cable car pulling something over there? Huh. Is that you zip line down there? So they're not construction workers, they're zip lining there? So after they zip line down, they have to walk all the way back up. And what is happening? What is that? Is there a shuttle? Oh, there's a shuttle. I don't see anyone zip lining down though. It must be too expensive. I think uh, Sheena said it's like $200 or something to zip line down there. So, looks like you zip line and then you wait for a shuttle to go back up. What's that green tower over there? Bungee jump cliff? Nobody's up there. Random clock tower here, you can see it's a little past six. There's a big ball over there for what that is. That little bridge all the way over there. Yeah, the pictures come out way better than the video. Some little birds hanging out on that rock there. Whatever this thing is. A whole tour group from Korea here. It's a big bridge for that portion and a mini bridge just for that tiny little waterfall by itself. There's the stop start of the zip line. Oh, there's some people waiting up there. How come I don't? Oh, they're about to go. There's the zip line. I don't see anyone going. I haven't seen anyone go. See this whole zip line here? And they 
disappear in the trees. Oh, there they go. Seems pretty slow. That guy's the fastest because he's the heaviest. Put this random hut here so if it starts raining, everybody crowds under here and goes, Get in! Huddle under tree! <laughs> like, why is this randomly here? What is it for? <laughs> there's, there's nothing in here. <laughs> maybe, maybe they set up a little stand to sell stuff in it. Look at that. Like that brick design. See, no one's on that green tower. I don't know what it's for. I think it's for bungee jumping. I don't know. <laughs> They're going. Five dollars. Ten dollars. Twenty dollars. Thirty dollars. <laughs> That's how much it costs for each mile, for each line you go. <laughs> when you get to the bottom, two hundred dollars. <laughs> person spinning around. They closed the boat self-service. You gotta go over there now. Here's the prices. So $33.50 for adult, $23.50 Falls Fireworks Cruise. Okay. Found the side with the Canadian flag. It's in front of the Sheraton. Where did they launch it? From there or here? So windy. Three. What are those? Kites? I don't even know they're balloons. Oh, balloons. They're flying away balloons. I see a four. And whatever those thingies are. There's a hard rock cafe over there. And a casino. It's a uh, H Rock. Okay, they got washrooms here, restaurant, restaurant, gift shop, and observation. Coming down. Okay, all the lights are turning on now. Like that little tower has little lights on it now. We have a castle Dracula over there. Oh, and some people walking in front. Yo, Wendy's. <laughs> There's a little waterfall there. Rock, rock, <laughs> all these bricks are all like have like a pathway from too many people walking on it or something. I don't know. <laughs> There's that little. What's that? It's a little gazebo thing. I'm gonna walk about four kilometers to go to a Vietnamese restaurant and then walk back. Hopefully, we make it in time for the fireworks. We got sweet Jesus over here. <laughs> sweet Jesus. <laughs> What's that? Why is that Mario falling over? <laughs> the dinosaur up there. I don't know what those Pokemon in are over there. Niagara Brewing Company. Wow, where are we going? <laughs> Pirate ship. Is that mini golf there? There's a big spinny ball. Midway Canadian. Fun house over here. Shovel Lodge, Canadian Midway. It's weird that there's like a... They have a haunted house here. Haunted house. Maze of lasers. What is this? <laughs> Dracula Haunted Castle. Lots of people in there. There's the Ferris wheel. Canadian moose. Moose in Canada are blue. <laughs> yeah. Is that Ripley's Believe It or Not? Yep. Ripley's Believe It or Not with King Kong. Desert Golf, IHOP, Applebee's, Burger King. 
was that Kelsey's Crystal Caves Mirror Maze Adventure. That gargoyles up there. Beaver Tails, famous pastries. Kelsey's original discount souvenirs. <laughs> Mountain Subway. All random. Canna, cabana, cabana, nananas. <laughs> Burger factory, fries, funnel cakes. Just tell people we're in Vegas <laughs> with all these lights. Why is there a Tim Hortons in Vegas? <laughs> the Yanks here, Cuban cigars, Tika Katana Junction, Locomolo Land. <laughs> New York? We're not in New York. What is this? Chinese Canadian. We made it to New York. <laughs> We crossed the border. <laughs> we walked through. They let us through without our passports. There's a Royal Pan. There's a motel. Super 8. Oyo Hotels. Days Inn Suites. Lots of hotels here. Punjabi Indian Cuisine. Punjabi. But, oh no! Parking's only $10. We paid $35. We parked at the wrong place. <laughs> Now we know. If you come, don't park anywhere near the falls. <laughs> Here's the post cereal. <laughs> Indonesian coffee. I don't know what my thing stopped recording sometimes randomly. There's the Olympia Motel. If you walk out here, it's free parking probably. You just park like- oh no, they even have a parking booth there. I don't know what that costs. But. No, they closed the Olympic pool at the Olympic Hotel. <laughs> we can park and use the swimming pool for ten dollars. <laughs> or do you have to pay ten dollars to park there even though you're staying there? <laughs> you're staying here, ten dollars per car. Oasis Motel. No, we should have went here, it's five dollars. <laughs> It's okay, I, I hope I get more advertisements in that. Hopefully it's more busy. <laughs> Hopefully more people take pictures of my truck there. Color TVs? What? Since when do they have color TVs? <laughs> See, it's free if you park in here. <laughs> There's nothing there. <laughs> Just rammed through the gates. It didn't say no parking. <laughs> Look, there's a Canadian memorial in there. What, what war is that? What's in there? <laughs> Gas is $149.90. $149.90. Yeah. But it's per liter, right? Not per gallon. So that's more expensive, actually. Got a less than three kilometers to go. There's the police. They got the overly powerful police over here. OP police. <laughs> See, if you're traveling from the U.S., you'll be confused because the price is per, uh, per liter, and also it's uh, in Canadian dollars. So if you're paying, you'll be like, what does that calculate to U.S. dollars? And you'll be very confused. But if you charge electricity, luckily U.S. people decided to use kilowatts instead of pounds of electricity. <laughs> 2.5 kilometers to go. We walked really far away from the waterfalls now. The moon is covered in the fog. You can see that in the distance over there. So we passed the overpowered police. What is this one? This is Niagara Regional Police. Huh. So I don't know why they need two police. I guess if Niagara's police aren't good enough, they gotta send in the overpowered ones. So windy! They're having a hurricane here too! They're having Hurricane Canadian. <laughs> Two kilometers to go. Getting really windy. This is like in Florida, except these trees aren't breaking. <laughs> Look at their decorations. That guy was blowing over in the wind. He like leaned, he was doing a, what is it called? How low can you go? <laughs> Limbo, and then the wind, and then he went back up. 1.6 kilometers to go. We're almost there. 1.3 kilometers to go. 900 meters to go. 
this, this is the only house that's lit up. Everyone else is like in the dark. Hey, somebody sing out there. Trick or treat. <laughs> this house has a lot of firewood. You can see it's dark. No, kind of. Okay, we gotta somehow go somewhere over here. 700 meters. We made it, but my phone's almost dead. So hopefully they have a way to charge it. Otherwise, we're in trouble. We gotta find our way back in the dark. <laughs> no sign. Bumbal Hay, I asked them for fun noodles. And also another pho, and this is a rice dish. So here instead of cabbage, they use lettuce. You want bean sprout and I'll try. Oh, I forgot, we have tea as well, and it's like a peach tea. It smells good. The meat's very thin and tender, it falls apart. And these are the ham things. <laughs> Good. I didn't record because my phone was dying. I charged up at their station. Yeah, luckily they had a little USB wall plug, so I charged there. Finished all the food. It was good. Uh, the only thing is I wish it had more types of meat because it just had like the thin cuts of beef and then the Vietnamese sausage. Normally that dish, uh, you have like the pork blood cubes and like pig feet or something. So... This didn't have any of that, or not even like tendon or anything, but other than that, it tastes really good. And they gave us lots of bean sprouts, so yeah. All right, now we gotta get back. We're gonna walk back. I'm gonna record the fireworks, and then um, my dad's gonna drive the truck to go pick up my brother and Sheena, because they're still, they're gonna wait over there for us. And then after I record everything, they're gonna come back and get me, <laughs> since they already seen it before. Alright. Oh, well, it's really weird because this cuts through like this grass here. So we walk through this path. But when we were walking, it looks like we're going to nowhere. <laughs> so you see, we have this like path out here. See, we're going into this dark, unlit path here. I almost turned into that place, but we're going this way. <laughs> the clouds falling over. It's like, help! Help! <laughs> I got a speed trap right there. All the cars slowing down. <laughs> so here are the fire hydrants. They have these blue rings on them. So you see, they reflect at night. The park in the dark over there. 3.4 kilometers to go. This time we're going back to the car, so it's a longer route. So it's about five kilometers. Going on to Main Street. Wholesale club here. Whoa. European restaurant, Red Chateau. I'll follow this road all the way down back to the falls. Morse and Sun Event Center. Get in there. That building. What's that? We're getting there. You can see that little tower in the distance. Big church there. And they have the keg over there. <laughs> Look at that. that many Ukrainians nearby to be able to attend. Getting closer. Getting there. Yep, indoor skydiving here. Getting closer. Margaritaville. Going downhill now. Shoeless Joe's. Is they allowed to go in there without shoes? <laughs> a bridge all the way there. And another one. The mothership is dropping its babies. <laughs> Close 
closer. 1.6 kilometers to go. I wonder why they don't light that up. There's a, some lights, like a moon or something. Right, there you go. What? They blocked this place off now. How they do it. They have the lights coming from down there. See that? Oh, I can't see it when I zoom in. But it's coming from down there. So if you're wondering how they light this, like you said earlier, you see those lights up there? So those are projecting the light onto the waterfall there. Does the colors? <laughs> that's white. That's yellow. It's going to green. Now it's blue. How the colors change? They're doing it slower now for some reason. Going to white. Wow. That's how they do the color change. Now to red. Now to white. <laughs> Purple. Whoa. at the mist. It's like the Aurora Borealis. <laughs> Get how the light shines through that mist and doesn't make the mist all light up. Look at that guy. <laughs> all those lights. <laughs> Boats going down there. Wait, the dark. We started making the horseshoe waterfall rainbowy as well. And now that side's just solid colors. <laughs> it's not 10 yet, but I heard a firework go off. What? Still got 10 minutes to go. Where'd it come from? I didn't even see it. I just heard the explosion. Starting. There we go.
whitish and a orangish. But the camera is showing it like red and purple. Oh, it's beaming up one of its babies. The mothership's pulling it in. Back to the car. My dad, uh, he parked somewhere over here. Picked them up from the restaurant. I went back to watch the fireworks to get there early. And he got the car and brought it back to the restaurant because it was too far to walk. All right, there it is. Easy to find. <laughs> the app is really nice because it shows a dot on the map and it shows where I am on the map so I could easily locate it. there until midnight. It's going to take an hour and a half. <laughs> Something's happening. They blocked that whole road. There's one police car there and they, the whole road is empty. Counter traffic. Nobody's over there. Is the famous bagged milk. 